Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Today I've got this Rossi kit. This has been sent to me for review and they have asked me to be one of their ambassadors which I'm very happy about. Um, so yeah, they've sent me this um, fab They've sent me this Fan Faves kit and this is a dip powder system. Um, so they asked me um, if I would do a video on this um, and I said yes because I like the, um, the look of the website and I like the products, uh, the look of them. So this is the box and I'm just going to open it. I've already opened this so it might be a bit messy inside because... Um, I don't like waiting for things and I couldn't wait to um, open it and I've just noticed that I opened it upside down. Um, so it says the formula is created in the USA but it is made in the People's Republic of China. So, um, and there is a website, rossynails.com. So yeah, this box is a bit messy because as I said, I've already got these things out. So I'll get them out again. So you get three um sorry for powders with this and then you get your dip liquids as well so it says that it includes four shades three liquids so you've got a step two which is a base coat step three which is an activator and step four which is a top coat i've no idea what step one is because there isn't a one sorry about that i couldn't get into them so um let's just put them in the right order so you can see the quite big bottles so these should last a long time um, so let's have a look at these powders. Let's take these out. I've ripped the box on this one. So we'll take them all out first and then we'll show you what they are. So they're all 18 grams or 0.6 ounces, which is quite big. Okay, so the first one is this one. And this is called Mermaid 066. See if there's a seal on this. If there's a seal on it, I won't show you it. Yeah, there's a seal on it, so I'll have to take that off. Oh wow, look at that. Can you see that in there? Oh wow, can't wait to swatch that. Look at that, all that glitter. Oh yes. I love that one. So that one is the mermaid one. This next one uh, is called Skyscraper. This is a fine glitter one, I think. Oh, wow, it's holographic. Look at that. Oh, wow, can you see that hollow? Wow. Oh, yes. I love that one. So, obviously, these are dip powders. You can use them with monomer. Um, like you would normal acrylic, um, but I'm allergic to monomer, so I can't do that. So I will be using these as dip or any other way that I manage to do it. And I, I use gel. I use the gel base coat or I use the dip liquids, but I prefer the gel. Wow, look at that one. That is gorgeous. And I'm going to have to lift this up because I forgot to see what it was called. Vacay time. So that's like a holiday one. It's like a a coral try and focus in on that yeah it's like a, a coral with glitter in but more pink oh that is beautiful and look at that lid there it's all in the bottom of the lid how gorgeous is that okay and the last one is celebration this is another they're all glitter ones this is um This is a fine one as well. Oh no, it's got some chunky in as well, this one. If you see that one, it's more like a nude, this one. But you can't tell till you swatch them because they always look so different in the pots. But the fact that they look really bright colours in the pots makes me think that they're going to be really good to use. Okay, so I'm just going to package, um, well I'm not going to package them up. I'm just going to get ready um, and then I will come back and do some swatches. So I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so we're just gonna swatch these. Um, so we're using the number two, which is the base coat. So I'm just gonna put a coat of that on and then I'm gonna dip it in. Obviously I've sped this up because I'm putting three coats of each of these powders on the swatch stick. 
Um, so this first one, obviously it was my first try and I did wipe a bit off with the brush because I didn't leave it long enough to set. Um, the only dip liquids I've used recently have been the model ones um, and that sets a lot faster than this. Um, so it wasn't set when I tried to brush it so you do need to leave it a bit longer. I left it I think at least a minute uh, before I put the second um, base coat on and then dipped again. Um, I think this first one is absolutely gorgeous, this blue one. Um, so compared to the other dip systems I've used, um, I don't normally use the dip liquids because I don't like them. Um, I don't like the smell of them and they sting your eyes and things like that. But this one, um, it, I'm not saying it wasn't like that, it just wasn't as bad. It was a lot less smelly. Um, and it was yeah it was actually a pleasure to work with yeah so I think I will use these liquids and it's good that they've given me such big bottles because I can use them uh, so yeah I was impressed um, so yeah I've put three coats of the dip on and then um, I'll leave it to set and then I put the activator on and I put two coats of that on and then all of the colours I've just left um, to one side to completely dry and completely set before I put the top coat on, which is like the final stage. Um, so yeah, you do see me wiping the brush off on the kitchen paper quite a few times because I don't want to get loads of glitter in the base coat. So this second one is like a gold one and it's um, it's got lots of um, clear in it as well. Um, and then this third one, um, Vacay Time, this one, it's absolutely gorgeous. It's like a coral. Uh, with gold shimmer in it it's absolutely beautiful it really is so i love this one i think the blue is my favorite one because i am very fond of blue anyway but i love this one as well i love all of them actually but yeah this is definitely a favorite it looks gorgeous in the pot but it looks even more amazing on the on the swatch and it's a fine one as well and i do like the fine ones too so yeah, I think overall the quality of this dip kit is really good. It's the best one that I've tried. Um, yeah, the only thing I found was that when I opened the pot, um, they did have the protective seal on. And as soon as I took that off, um, I did find that if I moved them about too much when I opened the pot, the, the dip sort of went a bit everywhere. But that's my fault because I shouldn't really be shaking it about after I've took that. Um, that protective thing off so if you do need to you know shake them up a bit I'd say just stir it instead um, with a cuticle pusher or something rather than shaking the pot and then it won't go everywhere um, so I'm just top coating them now and I put two coats of the top coat on um, I'm not the biggest fan of uh, drying top coats because I don't think they have as much shine and as much clarity as gel does um, but you can see that it does it does look really good and if you can't use gel for any reason then this is a great system to use it is really good i was extra careful to make sure that i didn't um you know leave the bottles open too long or you know not screw the tops on properly because i really don't want to waste any of this liquid now that i know it's good and i like using it i don't want to you know make it go hard in the bottle so i think i did all right with that we'll see next time i come to use it um, but so far i've used this twice just to give a good review and i'm definitely happy with it so this is the blue one it's called mermaid it's absolutely gorgeous so that's got silver glitter in it as well it was so hard getting good film and good pictures of this these glitters because they just didn't want to show up and there is the vacay time one you just can't see that in per in, on the camera the same as it is in person it really is amazing it's gorgeous And that'll be perfect for holiday nails, that one. And the last one is Skyscraper. So that's like the grey hollow one. That's absolutely gorgeous as well. Um, so thank you so much to Rossi for sending me this kit. If you look at the top, there is a 20% off code. So make sure you use that if you make an order from their website. They do have dip powders, lots of different sets, and they've got gel polish as well. Um, so definitely check that out because 20% is quite a good saving. Um, so yeah, I hope you like this swatch video and I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye